James? How you doing, Max? Oh, nice. Nice. Um, you want to do some weapons training? Yeah, sure. First, do you know the correct response to a punch? Let's okay, see. let's do it. Hoi! Good job. Okay, well, um, that worked good, so now let's go do some weapons training for the trampoline. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is nunchuck training. Okay, ready? Take the sword. I'm gonna attack you twice with the nunchucks and you have to block it. Okay, okay. ready? Let's go. Okay, that was good. Now we're gonna do the set. Okay, ready? So, I'm just basically gonna do this with this one. And I'm gonna throw you over this way and try to stab you. And you have to basically hit my leg with the sword before I can stab you. Okay, ready? First time. And let's go. You got me. Okay, let's do it again. Other side. And I'm gonna throw you. You got me. Good time. Okay. Okay, now, you're gonna have the side, and I'm gonna attack the sword, and you're gonna have to block. Okay, okay, let's do this. Hit sword. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Good job. Okay. Now, you won't be needing those. Now, let's see if you can block this. Ow! Why'd you do that? No! No, 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 no! <gasps> oh, crap! I'm gonna be late for school! Okay, class. Um, I'd like for you to take a look at our next statue uh, on our field trip. And this one right here is supposed to represent uh, rain clouds over a boat on a stormy night. So I want you to take a moment to look at it and just kind of think about what the statue possibly means to you. So, you know, I had this really, really weird dream about you last night. Oh, really? I love it. So, we were just at my house and we were on a trampoline and we were doing some cool weapon training, but it was with real weapons. And all of a sudden, you just threw me down on the ground and killed me. What? But that is really weird sounding. But that wasn't even the weirdest part of the dream. The weirdest part was you were wearing these exact same clothes. How is that possible? You've never... I, I got these like yesterday. I've, you've, I've never worn... Like this is the first day I've worn them. You've never seen them. That's really weird. That is really weird. Huh. Okay, oh, do you want to go inside and play some video games? Yeah, sure, let's go. Wait, hold on, got a call. Yep, uh, I don't know about that. Um, oh, okay, yeah, I'll be right there. Okay, yeah, I gotta go. What? Come on, you, where are you going on your secret job? Well, no, I can't tell you that, it's secret. Come on, okay, well, okay, just go ahead. Okay, bye. it, see ya. Man, why is James acting so weird lately? And where's he keep going? Gosh, this makes me so mad that you won't tell me. Ugh. Maybe I should just go to the dojo and cool off some steam. Max? Yeah? You ready to train? Sure, let me go put in my backpack. Training. Okay, Max. Today is the day I teach you something I meant to teach you a long time ago. Okay. First, a test. Huh. Max, how did you know how to do that? That was the skill I was going to teach you today. It was, it was just, it was, it was, it was just all in a dream. Max, speak more clearly. I, I, Sensei, I think, I think I should just, just go home. I'm not feeling too good. That's a good idea. Bye, Sensei. Get in my backpack. What's that? It's a bomb!
Hello, Max. It was you who did this to me! The bomb, the explosion, it was all you! No, Max. Not me. Someone far more powerful. You're lying! You're a liar! Think about it, Max. Why would I blow up my own dojo? Fair point. But if it wasn't you, then who was it? I clearly don't know. Okay, then. How did I get here? I was outside when the explosion happened. I found you. You were badly hurt. I brought you here. I rebuilt you. But how did you know how to do that? I was an engineer when I was younger. I retired. Became a sensei. Are you sure you don't know who tried to kill me? No, but I do know that he's powerful and he's planning something terrible. Do you know where he is? I found a map in the wreckage outside the dojo. I believe that he is here. Work with me. Here's how we'll stop him. I almost just died and now you're expecting me to go and save the world? I need to get my revenge on him for what he did to me. Stay away from here. Never come back. Okay, Sensei. What do we need to do to stop him? Max, I found this picture of the three totems in the wreckage. Totems of life and death the totems of the forest, and the totem of the sea. If the totems come together, the consequences could be catastrophic. You must find them. Here it is, the totem of life and death. Oh no! Sensei! I got him. Great job. Give me the totems. Please, no, don't hurt him anymore. Give them to me. Sincerely, okay? 
Okay, Sensei. That's the last of your medicine for today. Drink that. Max. But don't survive. No, Sensei, don't say that! Max. If I don't survive, stop him. I will, Sensei. I will. I already know it's you, James. Looks like you figured it out. I'm going home with those turtles. Yeah, you forgot one thing. And what might that be? I'm a cyborg, meaning I'm basically a walking magnet. It's over. What happened? I stopped him. I got the totems, but I had to use the totem of life on life and death on you to save you. No, Max. You shouldn't have done that. You could have killed yourself. Sensei, you were about to die. I couldn't just stand there. Sensei? Yes, Max? It was James in the cloak. I knew it the whole time. What? Why didn't you tell me? I didn't think you would fight him if you knew. You know, I thought it was you in the cloak for a while. I'm too old to destroy the world. The totems have been destroyed. So what happened will never happen again. I'm still not sure if James is truly dead or not, but I bet he's out there somewhere. Mostly everything went back to normal. Except for one thing. My life will never be the same. I will forever protect this earth. A ghost. Too special to die, but too strange to live. So I'll do neither and be a silent protector in the night. <laughs>